which cells are primarily responsible for antibody production in the human immune system your options are t cells b cells natural killer cells or macrophages and the correct answer is b that is b cells b cells are responsible for producing antibodies and these are also known as immunoglobulins in response to pathogens these antibodies play a crucial role in targeting and neutralizing foreign invaders question number 2 which of the following is not a function of the human immune system your options are recognition of self from non self production of hormones defense against pathogens or removal of damaged cells and the correct answer is b that is production of hormones while the immune system interacts with the endocrine system it does not directly produce hormones its primary function include distinguishing self from non self defending against pathogens and removing damaged cells question number 3 which cell are responsible for engulfing and digesting pathogens in the human immune system your options are t cells b cells macrophages or natural killer cells the correct answer is c that is macrophages the macrophages are phagocytic cells that engulf and digest pathogens as part of the innate immune response playing a crucial role in the body's defense against infection question number 4 so friends you are attending 100 mcqs based on human immunity system immunology and this is the part 1 of this series and this session has 25 most important and most repeated questions based on immunology so do watch this video completely to get yourself more fit more perfect for upcoming questions based on human immunity system or immunology and if you like the video please do comment your learning and do comment your score the next part of this video will be uploaded tomorrow let's continue question number 4 which type of immunity is conferred by vaccination in the human immune system your options are passive immunity active immunity innate immunity or adaptive immunity the correct answer is b that is active immunity a vaccination stimulates the body's immune system to produce antibodies and memory cells providing long term protection against specific pathogens this process is an example of active immunity question number 5 which cells are involved in the cell mediated immunity of the human immune system your options are b cells t cells natural killer cells or mast cells and the correct answer is b that is t cells t cells play a central role in cell mediated immunity by directly attacking infected or abnormal cells coordinating immune responses and regulating the activity of the other immune cells next which class of antibodies is primarily involved in allergic reactions in the human immune system your options are iga igd ige or igm the correct answer is c that is ige ige antibodies are associated with the allergic reactions and are involved in triggering the release of histamine and other chemicals that cause allergic symptoms question number 7 which cells produce histamine in response to allergens and the human immunity system your options are b cells t cells mast cells or eosinophils the correct answer is c that is mast cells mast cells are responsible for releasing histamine and other inflammatory mediators in response to allergens contributing to allergic reactions such as 
itching, swelling and mucus production. Question number 8. Which type of immunity is transferred from mother to fetus through the placenta or breast milk in the human immunity system? The options are active immunity, passive immunity, innate immunity or adaptive immunity. The correct answer is B that is passive immunity. The passive immunity is acquired through the transfer of preformed antibodies from a mother to her offspring, providing temporary protection until the infant's immune system develops its own immunity. Question number 9. Which cells are primarily targeted by the human immunodeficiency virus HIV? The options are T cells, B cells, natural killer cells or macrophages. The correct answer is A that is T cells. HIV primarily infects and destroys CD4 plus T cells, weakening the immune system and leading to acquired immunodeficiency syndrome AIDS. Question number 10. Which cells are responsible for presenting antigens to T cells in the human immune system? The options are B cells, T cells, dendritic cells or eosinophils. The correct answer is C that is dendritic cells. Dendritic cells are antigen presenting cells that capture, process and present antigens to T cells initiating and shaping the adaptive immune response. Question number 11. Which cytokine is primarily involved in promoting inflammation and recruiting immune cells to the site of infection in the human immune system? Let me repeat. Which cytokine is primarily involved in promoting inflammation and recruiting immune cells to the site of infection in the human immune system. Your options are interleukin 1, IL-1, interleukin 2, IL-2, interleukin 4, IL-4 or, or interferon gamma. The correct answer is A that is interleukin 1, IL-1. The IL-1 is a pro-inflammatory cytokine that plays a key role in initiating and amplifying the inflammatory responses by recruiting immune cells and enhancing their activation at the site of infection or injury. Question number 12. Which cells are responsible for antibody dependent cell mediated cytotoxicity ADCC in the human immune system? Your options are B cells, T cells, natural killer cells or neutrophils. The correct answer is C that is natural killer cells. The natural killer cells can recognize and destroy the target cells coated with the antibodies through ADCC, contributing to the elimination of infected or abnormal cells. Question number 13. Which class of antibodies can cross the placenta from mother to fetus in the human immune system. Your options are IgA, IgD, IgG or IgM. The correct answer is C that is IgG. The IgG antibodies can cross the placenta and provide passive immunity to the fetus, offering protection against certain infection during early life. Question number 14. Which cells are involved in the production of antibodies during secondary immune response in the human immune system? Your options are memory B cells, plasma cells, T helper cells or eosinophils. The correct answer is A that is memory B cells. The memory B cells generated during the primary immune response quickly differentiate into plasma cells upon re-exposure 
to an antigen leading to the more rapid and robust antibody production during secondary responses question number 15 which cells are primarily responsible for killing virus infected cells and tumor cells in the human immune system your options are b cells t cells natural killer cells or macrophages the correct answer is b that is t cells cytotoxic t cells cd8 plus t cells play a central role in cell mediated immunity by recognizing and eliminating virus infected cells and tumor cells through direct cell killing question number 16 Which type of hypersensitivity reaction is mediated by IgE antibodies in the human immune system? Your options are type 1 hypersensitivity, type 2 hypersensitivity, type 3 hypersensitivity or type 4 hypersensitivity. The correct answer is A that is type 1 hypersensitivity. type 1 hypersensitivity reactions such as allergies and anaphylaxis are mediated by the release of histamine and other mediators triggered by the cross linking of ige antibodies bound to mast cells or basophils question number 17 which cells are involved in the destruction of antibody coated parasites in the human immune system your options are b cells T cells, natural killer cells, or eosinophils. The correct answer is D. That is eosinophils. Eosinophils can recognize and destroy antibody-coated parasites such as helminths through mechanism like degranulation and the release of toxic proteins. Question number eighteen. Which cytokine is primarily involved in the dif- in the differentiation of nave t cells into effector t cells in the human immune system your options are interleukin 2 il2 interleukin 4 il4 interleukin 12 il12 or interferon gamma ifn the correct answer is interleukin 12 interleukin 12 il12 IL12 plays a crucial role in differentiation of nave T cells into Th1 cells which are important for cell mediated immunity and the activation of macrophages. Question number 19. Which cells produce antibodies with diverse antigen specificities in the human immune system? Your options are plasma cells, memory B cells, T helper cells, dendritic cells or dendritic cells the correct answer is a that is plasma cells plasma cells are terminally differentiated b cells that secrete large quantities of antibodies providing the humoral arm of the adaptive immune response question number 20 which class of antibodies is the first to be produced during an immune response in the human immune system Your options are IgA, IgD, IgM, or IgG. The correct answer is C. That is IgM. IgM antibodies are the first class of antibodies produced during an immune response, serving as the initial line of defense against pathogens until other antibody classes are generated. So, friends, it is a time to comment your score. And friends, thanks for joining us on this exciting journey. If you enjoyed the quiz and learned something new, then give us a thumbs up and let us know in the comment section. And don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you never miss out on our upcoming exploration of fascinating topics in the medical field. Until the next time, stay curious, stay healthy. See you. Take care.